switching gears now, we continue to celebrate Black History Month by highlighting ways schools across the island are finding creative ways to honor those who played a key role in U.S. history. One school in West Hempstead has been doing the same Black History project for over a decade, but recently they made a change. It was connected to the Civil Rights Movement. Michael Paul is a U.S. history teacher at West Hempstead High School. We had been doing the Black History Museum for a long time and it was live. Each year he encourages his students to get creative and think of an idea to honor Black History Month. You know, rather than writing a paper about it, you know, they do their own research and they create uh, like a, a museum display. And that's the kind of idea behind it. Those projects make up their Black History Museum. What is her character trait that allowed her to be successful? But of course, during the pandemic, they couldn't do it in person. We decided that we wanted to continue doing the project um, even through the pandemic. So we thought the best way to do that was to kind of change it into a virtual museum. OK, you can even put it on a new slide. Nicholas DiBenedetto is an ENL teacher who works on this project alongside Michael Paul and teacher Stephanie Borelli. Like you go into a museum and you have like different galleries. He compiled all the projects and created this pretty impressive virtual museum. How are we doing? You got your song ready? Turns out it was a change for the better and one they kept after the kids returned from remote learning. Maybe they're not great at taking tests, but they're amazing at drawing artwork. So it's really rewarding to kind of see these kids and their talent that we don't normally get to see on a daily basis. From posters to dioramas, even music videos. OK, so that's the next thing to think about. It gives these students full reign when coming up with creative ways to represent such important individuals in our history.